السلام عليكم ورحمة الله. This is Hani Ismail from Planning Engineer website. And this, in this video, I'm very happy to introduce our new productivity rates Windows application. If you find the links below this video, you can find two links. Link to the product page and link to download the program trial. So let me introduce for you the new program and in very simple steps in less than 10 minutes I will tell you how it works, how to activate your trial period and how to export data and see data in our new software. So whether you click the direct link below this video or the link for the product you will find the download link here. After you download it you will find this our program you need to install it just double click on it and as any regular uh, software you have to check where to install it and if it is accessible by everyone in your uh, computer or just your account and you will click next you may, fi you may find this screen just click yes and the program will be installed the program size is around 300 megabytes so it may take some time for the installation and here the installation completed so you need to close this window and you'll find a shortcut in your desktop so this is the first uh, launch of the program you will find this screen uh, if you try to go to any screen it will ask you for activation code but will give you a trial uh, period to activate your trial period just click this button enter your email and click activate this will give you three days to test the program and see all the features now I activated my uh, program let's go and see how it looks like we have three sections first section is productivity by activity in this section we made it very simple to find the productivity uh, per each activity so if we get the finishes for example you can find the uh, uh, most common activities the unit and this is the hours per unit uh, we made the first uh, section is very simple and we also uh, finding and uploading new data so it will be very easy for you to find any activity so this is the activities we have this is a division of work you can find the activities and as we said first section is very simple now we'll go to the second section which is activity information and details in this section we made it for uh, planning engineers and site engineers who uh, want to know more about the construction activities so if we choose uh, division 9 for example you can click here any activity you'll find we have a lot of data here we have huge data and you'll find a description and a photo for each uh, activity according to the division of work you can enlarge any photo of course and you can even search like if we are uh, searching for tiles we can just type the tiles and you'll find the ceramic tiles uh, this is very important for people who are looking for uh, definition or good definition for some activities they don't know also we are uh, uh, populating here the activity main predecessor and main successor so it will give you a very good idea about uh, planning when you are sequencing the activities what is what is before and what is after so uh, in the third section here and this is the most detailed section you will find a huge data for productivity but we divided it by division and subdivision of work so if we go to like machinery and then you have to choose what is a subdivision let's say stone you'll find a very detailed information about the productivity rate this is a division name subdivision name unit 
uh, BOQ item and here is the crew details what is the recommended crew for this item and what their hours per unit so uh, according to this one you can do your plan you can monitor your uh, teamwork and so on also you can search here or maybe filter by uh, unit also okay so as you can see here it is very simple yet it has a very detailed information in the trial period you can find all the uh, details of the program but you cannot use the export or the update since this is very iterative and we always doing and updating our program with new data so this is very important to have an update and it is also visible to have export to excel so let's say you decided that this program is suitable for you and you need it to have the full features you can simply go to our website you will find this is a product page if you are purchasing it for the first time and we have here two options the first time and the update period the first time is when you uh, purchase the uh, product for the first time it will give you activation key this activation key will give you 360 days of free updates however after this period is finished the program will continue working it will not stop but you will not be eligible to receive uh, a new updates so simply if you uh, selected first time you can add to your cart or maybe you uh, press check by paypal and uh, make the transaction very fast and the most important thing here is after you finish let's uh, show you how to make it in very simple steps you can put your details here and you have three payment methods credit card paypal or direct bank transfer you select the suitable uh, payment method for you click the i have read and accept the terms and click place order or continue to the payment according to your option okay now you receive a code and this is the most important that to activate your program so i'm going to copy this code now i'm telling you how simple it is i'll add the code and i'll click activate so i just activated now my uh, program and let's see what is the differences first when you click any section here you will find that you are able to export the data so if I choose here let's say finishes and I selected here the tiles and I need to filter by square meter and I need to export this data for Excel so I can have here by by division and by profession the required information for me it's very simple go to here and click excel you select where to save it and let's say save and that's it now you can open the file and you can find it organized exactly as you see in your screen and here is a file it is grouped by division and subdivision and the item you can use these hours these hours bare unit it means if you have here for this item let's say 100 meter you want to multiply these hours by 100 to get the hours for the manpower and the equipment so uh, uh, these columns are uh, according to the item you selecting so if you select different item you'll find different column let's say here you'll go to electrical and we'll select from the subdivision let's say lighting you'll find different column and different equipment i wish you'll find this program useful for you and we are enhancing it and keep updating so don't forget when you purchase this program to check for update regularly because we will 
always update the data and your feedback will make us uh, improve the program and make it a very good reference for all engineers. Thank you very much and I wish you will enjoy this program.